that music of Giuseppe Verdi, we welcome you to this special presentation by members of the Chicago Lyric Opera Orchestra, celebrating what would have been what should have been the beginning of another new opera season in Chicago. I'm Carl Grapentine, formerly from WFMT Radio. We began with the triumphal march from Verdi's opera Aida in an arrangement for brass quintet. The five players from the orchestra were Bill Denton and Channing Philbrick, trumpets, Neil Kimmel, horn, Mark Fisher, trombone, and Andrew Smith, tuba. Ever since Lyric Opera began, and that's 1954, the orchestra has taken part in every opening night and is an essential part of the company. And these performances are their contributions to your enjoyment in this very different fall of 2020. We have two more selections to begin. First, concertmaster Robert Hanford, along with pianist Andrea Swan, playing one of the most famous violin solos in opera, the Meditation, or Meditation, from Jules Massenet's opera, Thais. The arrangement is by Martin Pierre Marsic. And then we'll have an arrangement of one of Puccini's most famous melodies, the aria O Mio Babino Caro from Johnny Skiki. This arrangement is by Adam Lesnick and will be played by Elise Johnson, flute, Judy Kolb, oboe, Susan Warner, clarinet, Praman Tilson, bassoon, and Jonathan Bowen Horn. Enjoy. Thank you. 
Hello, I'm Eugenia Cheng. I'm a mathematician, pianist, and opera lover. I'm so honoured that the Chicago Lyric Opera Orchestra has asked me to introduce some of their wonderful musicians for this event. During these difficult times, I've loved seeing more of the orchestra musicians thanks to their online virtual performances. Usually they're hidden in the pit, but that doesn't mean they're unimportant. They're the heart of everything. My favorite place to sit at the opera is the front row so that I can have a really good view of the orchestra and feel overwhelmed by their amazing sound. I'm happy to introduce some of my favorite music today. First, Musetta's Waltz from La Boheme, composed by Giacomo Puccini and arranged for string quintet by Matthew Norton. It's performed here by violinists Heather Wittels and Diane Durafog Robinson, violist Melissa Trier Kirk, cellist Mark Bramfenbrenner, and bassist Andrew Anderson. And then the entr'acte to Act Three from Carmen by Georges Bizet, arranged for trio by the performers, who are Marie Tachouet on flute, Susan Warner on clarinet, and Marguerite Lynn Williams on harp. Thank you.
I'm Jack Zimmerman. Back in the 1970s, I was a young trombonist who was sometimes hired as an extra player by the Chicago Lyric Opera Orchestra. I've been a big fan ever since. For the next selection, the quintet from the orchestra's brass section will return to perform the flower duet from Leo DeLave's Lock May. After that, members of the orchestra's woodwind section will perform their Vogelfanger Bin Ich Ja from Mozart's Magic Flute. The selection is arranged for woodwinds by Joseph Heidenreich. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hello, I'm Steve Robinson, and from 2000 to 2016, I served as general manager of WFMT and the WFMT radio network. And in that capacity, it was my great privilege and honor to work on many different programs and projects with the Chicago Lyric Opera Orchestra. I got to know many of the musicians, and many of them are still my friends today. Even more important, as you know, and as you've heard in this presentation so far, this is one of the greatest opera orchestras not just in the United States, but in the world. It's a great orchestra in its own right. And I know you appreciate having them in Chicago, as do I. Uh, the Lyric Opera Orchestra helped WFMT in many ways. I remember, for example, that Laura Miller, who plays in the orchestra, never failed to come to one of our pledge drives. She would sit on the phone all morning and help us uh, take calls from listeners. She never missed a pledge drive. And that was true of many of the members of the orchestra. So it was a great relationship, and it's my great privilege to have worked with them. And as you've heard uh, so far in this program, it is a great orchestra. And we're going to conclude now with a performance of the Bacchanal from Samson and Delilah by Camille Sanson. The video editor and executive producer is Doug Waddell, and the audio engineer and technical advisor is Ryan Waddell. Please enjoy, and thank you very much. Thank you. 